Find out how Phil Ivy paired with an unlikely companion to beat the casino for millions. The high-stakes card game of Baccarat is popularized by the likes of James Bond and Frank Sinatra. Unlike poker, it requires no intuition or creativity. But for one man, Phil Ivy, Baccarat became a game of skill. Ivy discovered a technique known as edge sorting, which allows a player to detect asymmetries and manufacturers patterns on the backs of playing cards. This technique, although known for ages, is very hard to master and utilize, and even harder to catch. Ivy used this technique to exploit the game in 2012, playing marathon rounds of Baccarat at casinos in New Jersey and Britain. His winnings were staggering, in four visits to the Borgata Hotel Casino and Spy Atlantic City, he won about 9.6 million, and in a two-day Baccarat binge at Crockford in London, he won over 10 million. The casinos investigating Ivy's alarmingly large winnings cried foul. They accused Ivy of using edge sorting, a technique that is prohibited in most casinos. Ivy, however, denied any wrongdoing and claimed that his success was due to his skills as a seasoned gambler. The crux of this entire battle centers around the controversial practice known as edge sorting. In essence, a player who uses this technique can detect asymmetries and patterns on the backs of playing cards, allowing them to recognize cards that have been rotated. This can give the player a significant edge in the game, as they can know when an advantageous card will be dealt and adjust their stakes accordingly. However, using this technique has some very important requirements. First and foremost, the player must train their eyesight vigorously. They must be able to discern the minuscule difference in the pattern while one of the edges is sticking out of a shuffling machine. Additionally, they would need to find a compliant dealer who would allow them to turn the cards and keep the same deck between the games. In Ivy's case, the mastermind behind the whole endeavor was his Chinese companion, Chun Yin Sun. She had been a regular customer of U.S. casinos for ages, and after a stint in a Las Vegas prison due to an unpaid casino marker, she was filled with a lust for revenge. Edge sorting turned out to be a perfect means of accomplishing her goals. After meticulous studying and hard training, Chun mastered the still obscure technique and set out on a Baccarat rampage. She made quite the reputation in certain circles and quickly became known as the Queen of Sorts. To strike big, she still needed a VIP partner, and Phil Ivey was the perfect candidate. Ivey's tremendous bankroll and reputation meant that they could receive the white glove treatment from any casino they chose. This consideration from the staff was crucial for the success of their plan. With Chun's edge sorting ability, they could flip the advantage on its head, potentially yielding a 6.5% advantage to the player. The story of Phil Ivey and Chun Yin Sun is one of deception, skill, and ultimate a battle against the casinos. The use of edge sorting may have been prohibited, but for Ivy and Chu, it was a means to an end, and a way to beat the odds.